Hello, I'm your host, Ray Stambo, and I'm here for more New Year's tricks you can do for New Year's and to celebrate 2018. Because we're in year 2018, um, you can see some really amazing, amazing things that you can pull off with your friends and family. Here we have tonight, I got 18 tricks that, that you can do. Now let's get to our first one up, and that is the Magic Submerging 2018 Sign Magic Trick. Here is the performance. Okay, you can see here, here is my 20, and here is my my 18 right here. How about if I can actually put these together and have them submerge to make the year 2018. Okay, let's take these in here like this. I'm going to just take that paper and submerge it together. Watch. Comes together making our year 2018. Want well, to know how this master trick is done? I'm about to reveal the secret behind it right now. Here is what you'll be needing for this magic trick. Okay, so all you'll need is just a um, white sheet of paper. You're going to put actually the year 2018 on one. And on the other one, you're going to actually put the year 2018 and separate them. So it's separate. With this one here, you can actually fold this one like this. And palm like this. Like just like this. Hold. So now you're going to show two separate ones like this. So here you get the uh, 20 and you get the 18. You're going to put them together. And as you do that, you're going to actually put this into your hand. And you're going to slip it into your hand here. And with your other hand, you're going to push this down to the ground. Like that. You're taking those two halves are in this hand. From here, you're going to take your hand and start to submerge them together. Once it's done, take the piece of paper and unwrap it. Then by magic, putting it together, putting it together, to where it says 2018 on a one sheet. It's a really cool trick that you could do get yourself into for the New Year's. It will absolutely make everyone's day when they see those two halves that magically get submerged and into one creating the year of 2018. It's a very it's a very crafty one. I fully I fully recommend. Amanda. And that is how you do the Magic Submerging 2018 sign magic trick. Now for our second one, and that is the Disappearing Jack in the Middle card magic trick. Here is the performance of what it looks like right now. So you can see I got this Jack right here. Gonna take a look at the front and at the back. And what we can do is we can actually just is to make this completely vanish. And not instead, can just magically just make it appear back into the card again. Watch.
You wanna know how this trick is done? So I'm about to reveal a secret behind it right now. All you need is one old card. Card. And you're gonna actually is use an exacto knife, but be careful because the blade is sharp. And you're gonna actually do like uh, get out a square little piece out like this. In the in the middle of the face card. Because of it being so fine, as it put it together and hold, it looks like a legit face card on the back and the front. All you're going to do is you're going to actually is pop this. It's going to rotate down. This is going to get palmed into your hand like this. Just... Okay, so it, it here is completely gone. It really is just right here. Now to make it reappear, all you gotta do is push the thumb, push it back in, revealing it in the inside. You're gonna do this with covering it with your left or right hand. So it'll look like this. The best bet is to use your middle f finger as you are covering it, so it's extra fast. Now using your thumb and putting it back into position. And that is how you do the disappearing jack in the middle card magic trick. Now for our third one, and that is the vanishing third card magic trick. Here is the performance. But first, I need some cards. Getting from thin air. And now, let's continue on. As you can see, I got three cards here. Take a look, we got the four of diamonds, the two of diamonds and the six of diamonds. Okay. If you're gonna take a look at this two, it's gonna actually make this third card vanish. So from here, you're gonna see the the uh, the uh, two right here. Watch. You're gonna actually. Just take these cards up like this. You can see here? Watch. I make the third card completely vanish. And now, you want to see it come back again? You can see it got only two cards. Watch. And it comes right back. When well, this is done, we put the reveal secret right now. All you need is three cards. Bicycle cards. What you're gonna do is you can you can have I guess back here, take a look at the cards. This a legit uh, cards. And then I got ideas so you can uh, just uh, they can pick which one that they want. I say they pick the six. Okay. Put it into the middle. And you want to make it vanish. So how to make this vanish is very crafty. Because as you put the cards together, you're gonna actually put the card on top of the other card, like this. So now from here, you're gonna see that there's only two. Making that third banish, but really, it's right back here. Make, make it reappear. All you gotta do is reverse it by putting the cards back. And then using your thumb, pointer, and middle finger as you rub, rub the cards and, and fan them to make it appear like this. And that third card will magically appear back into 
the fan that you just made. And that is how you do the vanishing third card magic trick. Now for our for our fourth one, and that is the Edelfane rap trick. There is the performance to you right now. Okay, you can see this nice red um seal wrap here. There's something pretty magical of this. And actually bend it while it's being straight. Watch. And watch. Bring it back. When all this is done, I can reveal a secret behind this this elophane rap trick. Okay, here's this one simple thing, and that is getting some seal wrap. Now, because of the seal wrap, as you put and move it in, it will actually become um, static, which is it will come back to you by static. What you're gonna do to make a bend and come back to you is you're gonna rub. The seal the is actually like tapping in that New Year's magic. And this is going to actually charge up the wrap. Hold with your fingers straight like this. With your hand, bring it over. And it will start to bend, going straight. Like this. And I'll try this right here. So you're going to hold it nice and firm. Make it bend. Kind of flimsy, so get up just you know just practice this a little bit here. And then once it starts to bend, bring it back by holding it over, and making it come back. But must stay nice and straight as you're you're doing this. So here again, it'll, it should look like this. And that is how you do the cellophane wrap trick. Now for our fifth one, and that is the Magic New Year's Hover Party Cup trick prank. Here is the performance. Okay, so you can see my um, New Year's Party Cup here. I'm going to actually set this into my hand. Watch. This. Now, you guys can take a look at the back of my New Year's party cup. You can see. When all this is done, I'm going to reveal the secret behind it right now. All you need is two simple things your New Year's party cup. You can, look, you can get this at your local Bucket 2 or Jack the Mall where they sell these. Party cups. Next, you'll need is some transparent tape. You're gonna take this a little bit off, and then kind of make it like a double side by just by giving and just by twirling it up like this, like this, so it's nice and sticky. You're gonna take your your party cup with 
the logo thing uh, facing the audience. So, is it here? All you gotta do is we're gonna show you how it's completely empty. Gonna now stick your thumb onto that tape when you reach down to your palm of your hand. So, let's stick like this. Hold your fingers out so it looks like it's hovering. From here, it'll look like this. Careful not to expose your thumb. So kind of like have it at an angle. Fingers kind of broke out a little bit. Just to show that the uh, party cup is now hovering. You can push your thumb out a little bit to um, help carry out the trick. Once the trick is done, all I gotta do is remove the tape very, very quickly and palm palming it into your hand and then have the spectators take a look at your New Year's party cup all over. They can also feel it too and watch them be literally amazed and impressed that you actually um, hovered a New Year's party cup in the palm of your hand. And that is how you do the Magic New Year's Hover a Party Cup Trick Prank. Now for our seventh one, and that is the Magic Shrinking Wine in Cup Trick Prank. Here is the performance. Okay, so as it is, I'm gonna actually reverse that one. I put my strong apologies to that one, guys. Okay, and the, the one that I was going to say was the mysterious floating New, New Year's cup trick. And if, I'm going to show you that, and we'll move on to our, our seventh one. Okay, so I'm going to actually is just put myself some, some nice wine sparkler here into my uh, cup here. Watch this. And when all this is done, the bunch of feel a secret behind us right now. All you'll need is a special cup made up for yourself. The cup is actually a clear cup. Gonna put two little holes on each side and thread your fine thread through. And you can add a little twist tie. This is gonna now give you a loop that you could actually dress this onto your hand like this. To make it nice, all you need is some some wine. What we're going to do first is we're going to actually put this up into your hand like this so it looks like like a natural cup setting. Take your sparkler wine, dump it in. Because of it being weighted, it's going to stabilize the cup so that way it'll stay solitaire in this space. From here, you're going to take your hand, hold, into the palm, like this. L let go, very slowly, move your hand away, and it'll stay suspended in space, and be, f be floating. Come back, go under. And bring back into your hand what what was was in to end the trick. And that is how you do the mysterious floating New Year's cup trick. Now for our seventh one, which is magic shrinking wine wine in cup trick prank. Here is the performance. So you can see here I got my cup here. I'm gonna actually pour some wine 
into it right here. Okay, watch. You can see now it starts in an instant to shrink. How is this trick done? I'll show you a little secret behind it right now. All it is is another one of those uh, clear cups. What it's going to do is going to poke a hole in the b b bottom, close to the uh, bottom. You're going to cover that with your thumb. Like this. Put pressure on it so the liquid does not come out. You're going to pour your wine in the inside of that. So the wine stays into, into the cup. What's gonna do is, as a picture here, like this, it's gonna leak out like this from the hole, causing it to shrink. Gonna to 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 this like this. Down. Hold your hand down so that the drips go down. And something different that the way they don't get to see the drips. All they seeing is the wine that is shrinking in your cup. Makes a really cool trick prank that you can pull off for the New Year's. Go, go, go out with it and, and impress those around you with the sort of shrinking wine in cup. And that is how you do the magic shrinking wine in cup trick prank. Now for our eighth one, which is broken and restored wine, wine glass trick prank. Here is the performance of what it looks like. Okay, you see, here got some wine in my, in my wine glass here. Okay, you can actually just you know, see if I can try to take a drink. Oh, suit! I just broke my wine glass. <laughs> no worries, let's see if I can try and, try and, and just refix it. Watch. It refixes itself. But you know how this is done? It's a very simple one. I'm going to teach you how it's done right now. All you'll need is your wine or sparkler into a wine glass that's actually a plastic one. You can see? You're going to hide this piece. Like this, with your fingers, so they don't get to see that piece right here. This actually fits in like this. You can, you can get these in the um, kitchen part in, in the bucket too, or like that. They're, they're made out of plastic. It looks like glass, like a glass, like a, like a glass. All I gotta do is just loosen it up just a little bit. Hold it, and as you do that, you're gonna actually move it and break it off like that. Be careful that they don't see this. That way, it looks like they, like they've seen that you actually broke the wine glass. To reheal it, all you gotta do is place it back on, keeping your two fingers, your pointer, and your middle finger, and brush away. Amending the wine glass. And that is how you do the broken and restored wine glass trick prank. Now for our ninth one down, and that is the magic drawer box magic trick. Here is the performance to you right now. Can you see my, uh, my uh, drawer box is going to actually by magic is open it. Watch.
know how this is done? I can feel sick of hands right now. All you'll need is like this little fine matchbox. Nice, I'm gonna paint it nice and black so it looks nice and formal. You're gonna actually tape your fine line to it on the back using the sleeve as coverage. All you need is a little ring they are going to place onto your thumb, like this. So that way, as you extend it, it will open up. Hide the ring with your other fingers, like this. Like that. Hide. Make that little drawer open. Go put it back like this. And you can do that as well too. So you can do it different ways and you'll still get the same result. So really cool one you can do and pull off for the New Year's. And that is how you do the magic drawer box. Magic trick. Now for our Hence one down, and that is a magical black band to bow, bow tie trick. Here is the performance of what it looks like to you right now. So you can see you got this black band here. I'm gonna place this onto my neck like this. Watch. A bow tie magically appears. How is this done? Let's put a little sticker behind right now. It's a very classy one to get yourself into for the New Year's. All you need is this gold bow tie. It has a black strap onto it. All you gotta do is full fold it and palm this into your hand. Dress the elastic all behind like this so it looks like the black band. Put this onto your neck. Let that go very quickly and make the gold bow tie magically appear onto the, the black band and mounted onto your neck. And that is how you do the magical black band to bow tie tr trick. Now for our 11th one down in it is the Daddy's Rolling Coin and Card and Cup magic trick. There is a performance of what it looks like to you right now. You can see got my empty cup here and got my, my a gold coin. Watch this. Watch. Completely dissolves. And now for the card, I'm going to hold my hand over and watch. Let's put this in. Watch, the two completely dissolves into the cup. How is this trick done? Let's put a few to get behind it right now. Okay, so here's what, what I need. All you need is this window like glass here, a bit of plastic back here. So as a whole, like this, it looks like an actual empty cup. All you need for this. Are two little things a card and a nice gold coin. To make the gold coin vanish, what I gotta do is just drop it in here. From here, it looks like it mysteriously just dissolved. For the card, you can actually use your hand for coverage. Card goes back here, hand goes here. The other thing is in the cup. You move your hand away, and by magic, making that card dissolve as well into the cup. It's a really cool illusion. You know, fool everyone, and to be wowed and amazed that you actually dissolve two things: a coin and a card, with that with the cup that I've just shown you. So what you could do and pull off around the, the New Year's. 
And that is how you do the dissolving coin and card in Cup Master Trick. Now for our 12th one down, and that is the Magic Lindor Bag Trick Prank. Here is the performance. Okay, so I got my Lindor bag here and my cola can. The piece is on top. Let's see, it's still there. Okay, if we can, if we can put, it, put it in like this. Watch. And now, if we go like that. Okay, now watch this. I'm gonna store it. How was this trick done? Let's reveal the secret behind it right now. All you'll need is a Lindor bag, an empty one, and a cola can. Now, how this is done, I'm gonna show you from a different angle on how this is performed. Okay, from here, I put the, the can inside. And I take it in, I'm gonna actually put it like this, and I rotate the Coke can down. So if you can get still in that bag, I press it down. I let it go, but this time I'm gonna I'm gonna palm it like this. The bag now can be inspected. Now from here, I snap and I move it out to restore the cup that you once saw me smash it. And that's how you do the magic Lindor bag chip prank. Now for our 13th one down, and that is the Magic New Year's Gold Coin Hat Magic Trick. There is the performance. So you can see I got my gold, my gold coin, and I got my New Year's top hat here. Watch. Okay. Again, I'm going to do that same thing again. Watch. And now for the last. How is this trick done? But to reveal the secret behind it right now. All you'll need is four gold coins, a party top hat, which is kind of small, you can dress it up with a gold band, or a happy 2018 or whatever what you want to do for the New Year's. All you gotta do is blow these coins out into your head. One stays out. So as you put in I gotta just look up the, the next one. The PS, same thing again. Dump, and again, like that. So it'll look like this. Which makes the perfect message that you could do and pull off for the New Year's. And that is how you do the Magic New Year's Gold Coin Hat Magic Trick. Now for our 14th one down, and that is the New Year's Changing Tie Magic Trick. Here is the performance. Okay, you can see my uh, nice tie I have on here. You can see, look. Watch. You can just try to take this tie like this. Watch. You can see. How is this cool FOMO trick done? But to feel the secret behind it right now. Here's what you'll need for this trick. You'll need two ties tied together. One bigger and one short. Place in the back here, making sure they stay nice and even. Make sure you have a nice collar. What you're gonna do is you're gonna hold your fingers so that it looks like one. Like this. Take the flap this a little bit away get that change and hold 
with your hand like this. From here, you're going to now is use the other hand and even change it by pushing it down, sewing the change. And then again, pins back and pull your tie for forward. And that is how you do the New Year's changing tie magic trick. Now for our 15th one, that is the magic 2018 shades trip prank. Here is the performance. You can see the sign of 2018 on my shades. Watch. You can see, I rubbed it, and look. 2018. When all of this is done, we can reveal a little secret behind it right now. There is the secret setup that you're going to be doing. So all you'll need is your gold shades and an Expo marker. You're going to write 2018 on the inside of the shades and on the outside of the shades. With your Expo marker or dry eraser marker. Okay, so if I just wrote that in the back, you can't even rub it off because it was on to the back. You're going to do the same to the 18 on the other side. So you might have to look at it so that way it is even on each lens of your shades like that and then next you're going to do is you're going to actually is do the same over here making this a two this is zero make it nice and thick and same with the the other side then you're going to put your shades on you're going to rub this like this Clean it off a little bit. Look, it actually goes inside. Take it off, you can rub, and it does not come off. This here does rub off, but you're actually rubbing off this part. That way, you can rub, rub it, and you can also touch it as well, too. A really same trick you could do for the New Year's. And that is how you do the magic. 2018 Shades Trick Prank. Now for our 16th one, that is the Magic New Year's 4 plus 4 cards Magic Trick. Here is the performance to you right now. Okay, you can see here I got two fours, which actually, I have to go 4 plus 4 is 8, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two fours. I've got this one card, you can see my hand completely, completely empty, right? What I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually take these cards and make our eight. Okay. So as I just go like this now, I'm going to rub. Watch. And the, the, the two fours makes us. And number eight. How was this trick done? There's a bunch of little stick behind it right now. It's a very nifty one because all you'll need is four cards for this trick. Okay, because of 2018, eight stands out from that. And so what stands out are these two fours. Now, four plus four is eight. So making sure that you have an eight card in it as well. What it's gonna do is it's gonna have another card to hide the eight. Like this. Okay, so you're gonna show that you're going to the people are gonna obviously know that four plus four is eight. What's gonna do is so it has to play empty. Get the eight down, hold the eight into your hand like this. Because you're gonna put the two fours together. Bring up the eight card. You're gonna actually is pinch and move the eight and two up 
forcing the other force down. It'll drop to your lap. So they'll think the force on stone set here. And then all I gotta do is magically add them together to make the number eight. And that is how you do the Magic New Year's 4 plus 4 cards magic trick. Now for our 17th one down, and that is the New Year's coin flask trick. Here is the performance. Okay, so you can see my uh, flask here. Let's see what, what, what it reads. It reads, you look like you need another drink. Okay, because, because with that... You might need some change, right? And if I can actually open up, because this here is going to be really tough for me to take out a, an actual coin from from this watch. And get a toonie from the flask. How is this done? It's about to reveal. The secret behind it right now. All you'll need is a toonie or a loonie in the right currency and a nice uh, joke cup, which is what you see here. Uh, that, uh, you know, any readout. And all you got to need is a magnet. You're going to tape it on the back and tape your loonie or toonie on the back of it. This is kind of an awkward thing here. So it'll be kind of impressive when you see you pulling out a coin from this. So again, so it has completely empty. You're gonna hide this from here. As you, you, you do this, you're gonna actually move the, the loony like that by the covering of your hand. So from from here, take your thumb and move. Hold as it reaches here. I'm gonna pull out in the spout a coin. And that is how you do the New Year's coin flask trick. Now for our last one, number 18, which is the Happy New Year's chocolates plate trick prank. Here is the savory performance to you right now. Oh, okay, so you can see I got some chocolates here, and that nice sign that says Happy. New Year's 2018. It's gonna put some water into these little chocolates. Watch. You can see my chocolates are now flashing and giving a nice New Year's light show. Let's take a close up of this in action. Want to know how this is, is done? It's about to reveal the secret behind it. It's a very sweet and savory trick you can pull off for your friends and family. Here's what you'll be needing. Your New Year's setup of what you want as a, as a table setup. And all you need is just a white sheet of paper for the heading Happy New Year's of 2018. Which is what you'll see here. You can just to be creative and make a nice cool design on, on, onto it. You're going to tape it in the back of the plate right here. And what I'm just going to do is tape it down with some Transparent scotch tape. To do the, the chocolates, all you'll need are your blinking ice cubes. That's what they are. And you're gonna paint these things brown with brown paint to, to give the look of a real chocolate. Do it just vaguely, not like really call it on too much. 
That way, the floss will begin to sew right through the brown paint. Other things that you need to paint it, a paintbrush and your brown paint. Once you've finished painting these things, I'm going to just put it onto the plate. And you just add some water, which will activate the blinking. Best bet to, to go naturally is to go for a nice wine glass or a plastic wine glass will do. And fill this up with just a little bit of water. That is all you'll need to do this sweet trick. Next, you're going to take your little chocolates, put them onto the plate. And then pour that water into your plate. And now, the chocolates will begin to flash and give a nice New Year's light show. Let's take a look at these in the dark. And that is how you do the Happy New Year's Chocolates Plate Chip Prank. And now for our bonus one, which makes us 19, which is the magic. New Year's Appearing Coffee Crisp Magic Trick. Here is the performance. Okay, watch. A magic. Make a coffee crisp appear. How is this done? But we'll see good right now. Got a coffee crisp. Back. Nice sleeve on top there. Drill it out and catch it. That's all it is to it. There's no gimmicks involved in this trick. So you have something empty. And switch. And actually make a coffee, coffee crisp appear by hand. And if the trick is done, they can have a nice tasty treat. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Some music really. Reese Nilo.